Welcome to the Figure Zone. Today I've got another 1 6 scale third party figure preview. Now, again, these companies do not hold the rights to make these figures. They make them because they want to make them, and we buy them because we want to buy them. If you're uh, cool with that, cool. If you're not cool with that, cool. So, again, these third party companies make some awesome figures. Some of the quality is amazing on these things. And sometimes the big companies don't want to make these figures. The figures may be too obscure or just kind of uh, not going to be mass produced kind of figures. So they make these figures, we scoop them up. Let's see what we got today. Now we have three offerings from Thunder Toys. We've got the TD2023A, the 1 6 scale Hell Ranger standard version, TD2023B, 1 6 scale Hell Ranger deluxe version and the TD-2023C once to scale Hell Horse. And of course, this is based off of the Ghost Rider movie with Nicolas Cage. Now, normally this is Caretaker. This is Sam Elliott's character, also known as the Phantom Rider in the comics and also known as Ghost Rider, one of the first Ghost Riders. So that's pretty fracking cool. Uh, so the main thing is the basic version, the standard version, is uh, around 168 bucks. Now, all these are quarter one of 2022 releases. Now, for 168, you get the light up Ghost Rider head, the body, full costume, two hands, long gun, pocket watch, and the stand. Now, I always say go with the deluxe version, which is going to be 185, so a couple bucks more. You get the freaking Sam Elliott head. You need a Sam Elliott head. You can pretty much take that head, stick it on another body. You got yourself a Sam Elliott from the other stack of movies where he played pretty much Sam Elliott. <laughs> So, with this one, you get the Sam Elliott head, the light-up Ghost Rider head, the body, full costume. You get four hands with this one. The long gun, it looks like a pair of extra chaps you can put on them. You get a shovel, which is an exclusive to this also, pocket watch, and a stand. Now, with the Hell Horse, also quarter one, 2022, and it's around 200 bucks. Now, with this one, you get a leather harness for the horse. Now, the horse is resin horse with a light-up function. So that is fracking awesome. And it's a USB power supply. So hook that thing up into something. You're going to have your freaking horse light up for the whole entire time you want it to. That's really cool. No stupid fracking batteries are going to die in 20 seconds. Get a fracking light up USB horse. This set looks amazing. Definitely grab this if you are a Ghost Rider fan. Love the cheesy-ish movies. I enjoyed them. They're fun. They're a fun little ride. Great looking set. Detail looks Freaking amazing. Plus, you get a Sam Elliott head. Now from Art Figure is the AF-027 1 6 scale Master of Ocean figure. We know this guy, of course, as Ocean Master from the Aquaman movie. This outfit looks pretty fracking cool. There's so many pictures of him online, uh, it's hard to gauge what the costume looks like because underwater it looks bluish. When he comes out of the water, it's like a slightly different color because of the water is making it, the, you know, the crazy colors it is. So the attention to detail is really fracking great in this costume here. Now this is a quarter four 2021 release, and it's around 185 bucks, which is pretty fracking good. Now with this one, you get the head, the body, six hands, full costume, and you get his trident. And you can see the detail from the pictures from the movie and the detail of the costume are just dead on. They look really amazing. Awesome figure. You need some more DC villains there, so definitely scoop this guy up if you're into the Aquaman themes. Now the figure looks fracking amazing. 
The head sculpt, I'm thinking, looks kind of like the actor, except the hair is a slightly different color, and it's more like he just got out of the water and the hair is all pushed down as opposed to... Normally you see the actor in there, his hair is all kind of pushed back, and I think it's a little bit blonder in the movie, but the face sculpt looks not too bad, you know? You be the judge if you like this. No one's going to display him with the helmet off in the first place. Everybody's going to have him with his helmet on. No one's going to say, hey, there's Orm. No, you're going to say, hey, that's Frackin' Ocean Master on your display. And he looks pretty badass. They also have another figure of an Aquaman with the tattoos pretty much and like slight armor going on. I never got him because the hair is permanently up in the air, but it does look pretty cool with these two fighting together like it's an underwater battle scene. Pretty cool. From Starman is the MS-00616 scale heroin costume set. Of course, based off of Supergirl and most of the costume. So with this one, it's just a costume set. All you get is the head and the full costume. Well, the majority of the costume. You don't get a body with this one. In the photos, they use a TB League PLMB 2017-S22A body. So the S22A body is the one you want to get. You can get a different one if you want. It just match the head a little bit better if you use this recommended body. Now this is a quarter one, 2022, and it's only around 90 bucks for the headset. So uh, it's, it's pretty cool. It's pretty much it looks like the Justice League Superman costume, but missing the middle of it. Now the head sculpt looks pretty cool. It's like a generic head sculpt. I think they kind of went with just a regular head sculpt. It's not quite movie head sculpt, and it's not quite a CW TV series head sculpt. It's a little bit of both mix in there. So uh, it's pretty cool. It's a generic Supergirl. So if you don't like the Supergirl series, you don't want to look at her face all the time. Cool, you got this figure, and it's a generic Supergirl, so that's awesome. And this also doesn't look like a recast of the Supergirl figure that I have, which I like to cost a little bit better. This one's a little bit cooler looking, but uh, I'm digging on that Superman outfit. That's pretty cool. I wish they would have continued the full outfit, but I guess they wanted to go with something a little bit different, so uh, a couple Supergirl figures out there to choose from. This one looks pretty cool. Last up from S King S is the SKS 00416 scale male sculpt, quarter four 2021, and it's only like 45 bucks. Now, of course, this is a Superman head sculpt. Now, the thing is, this isn't a light up head sculpt. This thing only works with the Hot Toys Superman. So, pretty much, Superman has a light up feature inside, like the neck post kind of deal. And you just slide this head onto that neck post, and you get a light up feature. Now, I believe the Superman came with like an angry face light up head, but this one's like a not as angry face, so if you want another expression for your Superman, cool, go with this. 
Now I do have the S King S 1/6 scale flash head sculpt and the Wolverine head sculpt. And again, both of those excellent quality. That's definitely Ezra Miller and it looks amazing. And uh, it looked a little bit, I don't know, a tiny bit too small for the flash body, but I guess it looks okay if he pulled off the helmet, it would be a tiny bit smaller anyway. And the Wolverine, I don't have a body to fit this on. I tried fitting it on one of the Sideshow Wolverines that just came out, but uh, it looks a little bit too small and doesn't attach quite 100% easily on there. Thanks so much for watching. Please hit that subscribe button. It helps out my channel big time. Give it a thumbs up if you're liking the video. If you want to see more of these third-party previews, some one to scale reviews, some tutorials, and who knows what I might pull out next, hit the bell notification. And when I drop a video, you should be notified. Thanks again for watching. Until the next video.